Greetings! My name is Sora, and welcome back to Persona 5 The Royal. Uh, where we left off was in the middle of a cutscene, because I'm smart peoples. I... Where's the... Here we go. So, I'm pretty sure that the plot train we're on now is, is uh, the lead in to the next palace. Uh, we are in July, yes? Plot train, yes? A 18? 18, yeah. We're gonna have like a whole week of... Wait, 18. Wait. Is it plot? It is plot, right? It says 7, 18? I'm confused. Alright, well... I think it's supposed... No, it's not a plot. All right, well, we'll see what's actually happening. I may have stopped here in the uh, uh, the the cutscene for no for no reason, but we'll see. Uh, so we we can't look at the log. I don't know why, but uh, Morgana says, "Hmm, let's think about this after we get back. We don't have much time, so let's get going." Where are we going? I forgot. You know, it's been like four days. I've completely forgotten where we are. That's that's how good of a gamer I am. I don't know what we're doing. Damn, it's so hot. The holiday means it's as crowded on here as it is for morning rush hour. Hmm. That's right. It's firework time. It's the firework festival. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's the morning. So yeah. It is a plot time, but it is a single plot time. In between a couple of beef, stop it. Go away. Beef. I don't care. You're being the butt. Wait. So all these Sorry, people are going the to the fireworks festival? Ugh, this should be fun. Meow. No. Oh, it's so hot. Deal with it, Ryuji. You're wearing shorts and a no sleeve shirt. Those girls are way but too could you imagine what the yukata must be like? Must be taking time Actually, put on the yukata. no, the yukata is probably more airy. You two I'm thinking of a kimono. A kimono would be Not stuffy as hell. Like yukata. Man, you look way too right? On that. People often say that he to looks kind of good. There I say, oh, he looks. Way. Hot. Oh no, he's hot. I think that's a SpongeBob meme, and I hate it. We we don't know that yet. Are you going to the fire? Oh, that's right. For a us too. For a minute, I thought they were on and Makoto. I don't know why, and I have hair all over my face, and it's annoying me because Mr. Fluffy won't stop shedding. Sorry. I'm a horrible streamer. I'm so unprofessional. <sighs> Blah! Is there a way to just keep hair from flying everywhere? It's horrible. And now I have an eyelash in my eye. Armor gird. And I played with my mom's dog earlier today. Now I have dog hair on me. It's just horrible. Pets are horrible. I love them, but they're horrible. So, they're yukatas. Though they look a bit more like kimono. Those are really pretty. I want one. I would wear those rose uh, and pink any day. Give it to me. Now. Hey, B! Stop scratching the furniture! Get on? <laughs> Come on. One minute. Let's go together. Do you happen to be a model? You look great in that yukata. Waiting around to pain, God. so can we just go with these chicks? No, you're being a butt. If you scratch the furniture, you're gonna get your claw stuffed in it. Ah, I bumped the microphone. I'm so sorry. Your ears, they're dead. My my cat is being such a brat today. I don't know why. Maybe he's upset that I'm, I'm going back to work. Ah, and now he's yelling at me. Stupid cat. Uh, what was the question? 
Something about chicks. So we can just go with these chicks? <laughs> no. You gotta wait for An and Makoto. Senpai will kill you if you don't wait for her. That's enough. You're disgracing your Yukata. What? You should be more aware of your womanhood. Oh damn! Sick burns from Yusuke. How could you? Why don't you go after them then? So those are the kinds of girls you like, Ryuji. Uh Ryuji, stuck between no, a rock and a hard place. You know, Yusuke is such a pretty boy, but he is really missing out because of <laughs> I guess. But he's more likable since he stays true to his ideals. Definitely more than somebody I know. I heard that Ryuji's pretty much failed his exams. Oh. oh? <laughs> Ryuji. Mona, you little... I'm hey, pretty sure... Miss President said you're not allowed to be here if Agreed. you failed. But man, you both look amazing in Yukata. <laughs> Talk about Japanese beauty. Eh, I think the Yukata are usually prettier than the girl wearing them. Or, or like I think that's the point of the outfit. It's so animated. Look at those pretty fireworks. Hinabi, Hinabi. Oh no, it's raining. It's kind of funny how many times this kind of thing happens. Where it's supposed to be a really cool group hangout and then it get ruined. It, it gets ruined and they have to cancel. Show them legs. Nah, I'm kidding. <laughs> because she had. That's amazing. <laughs> Haru! She has screen time! <laughs> Actually, she had that screen time before. And that was to get out not the technically the first time we see her, but I guess everyone had the same idea. It was the first time the camera focused on her. What's up? Mm. I think I just saw someone I know. You mean the girl in that black car? So they're both well, third years at Shujin, but are there's no way they're in the same time class, right? Skills, Mona. We need you as a car. It's not possible in the real Sure it is, you're a cat! Cats can turn into anything. Festival's been canceled. I mean, you should have gone to the meat festival. We made such a commotion with the public, and this is what we get. <sighs> Lame. Aren't heroes that lurk in the shadows boring? I like the shade. <laughs> Cause I'm throwing shade at you, Ryuji. I want to change the world with a loud bang, like a huge. Ah, we'll get there. Again, Don't worry. Gonna find someone bigger than Kanashiro that easily. What is the rain is letting up? Though it's regrettable, we should go our separate ways for today. No, I don't wanna. You can't yeah, make let's me. Let's go home. Ooh. So you Hello. Tell me, no matter what. I have nothing more to say to you about that. What is? I see. What case, is future I wife doing here? You talk. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? Thanks for the drink. Ooh. I feel some threats going on there. Hey, hey we're not done here yet. Lovers quarrel. <laughs> I mean, as far as we know, Soji's quite the player, yeah? Yeah? Lovers quarrel. No, <laughs> moron. Damn. Soji's not in the mood. Wow, Sojiro's really not in the mood. It's the inkling! The cause behind the recent psychotic breakdown incidents is still unknown. On to other news. The international hacktivist group Majid has released a statement to the Phantom Thieves. Hacktivist. 
These are the details of the message that are posted on Medjid's website. To the phantom thieves causing an uproar in Japan. Do not speak of your false justice. We do not need the spread of such falsehood. We are the true executors of justice. So we're fighting anonymous. We're straight up magnanimous. We will Mag give you an opportunity to repent your ways. If you agree to a change of heart, we will accept. Hey, I see what you did there. If you reject our offer, the hammer of justice will find you. Justice, huh? We are Medjid. We hey! We will eliminate. I see what you did there. Akechi san, why do you think this announcement was made at this time? Yeah, we're fighting anonymous now. We are fighting the world. Well, okay, not quite yet. I love that. Medjid is probably my favorite enemy that they that they have to face. Although there are aspects to this Medjid that are very suspect. Put it that way. Yeah. I don't know the details, but there's no doubt that they were provoked by the Phantom Thieves. Whether it's a sense of rivalry or a simple attention grab, given the recent trends, I cannot say. Regardless, it's quite a nuisance. A nuisance? Both Mejed and the Phantom Thieves are nothing more than groups that uphold an egoistic justice. What a stupid thing they're getting riled up on. Phantom Thieves, huh? What in the world are they? You know about Me, me what? What? No! Ah, uh, who? I don't know. What are they Hearts, stealing? Hearts, don't you know? I'm still having trouble getting that part. Well, it's about time I go. Yeah, go home. Say hello to your girl. Also, about the stuff in the fridge. Well, I guess it's fine. Just don't use too much of it. <gasps> we can eat everything. It's possible that more people like these will continue to appear. Due to their influence. In that respect, the Phantom Thieves face a very serious crime. Eh? Akechi, why you no like us? Akechi, if I max out your social link, will you love me? Oh shit, I forgot those were on auto and I can't look. Oh well, I'll just skip them for now. These don't exist. You read and saw nothing. Pee 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 pee! I have a new message from the Phantom Thief chat! We gotta talk about Medjid. You mean those guys online are going nuts over? Oh, you mean those guys people online are going nuts over? Medjid. That name seems to come from one of the obscure gods from the Egyptian Book of the Dead. Medjid is a god. Really? Interesting. Hmm. Can I have a Medjid persona? I want I want the Medjid persona. I saw that too. For some reason, they think we speak of false justice. I love that she's fully into this Phantom Thief thing and is acting as if she has always been one of us. Makoto is best. I love her. Now then, what exactly did you want to speak of regarding Medjid? Well, why don't we go after them as our next target? What a sudden suggestion. I mean, they're like bad hackers or something, right? Technically, they're crackers. Um, so I know what the term cracker means in this, co in this, in this, uh, context. But for some reason, my mind immediately jumped to the racist connotation. Good job, Sora. Good job. Ugh. Cat hair, why? In my mouth. I'm not even allowed to breathe my air. I need a vacuum. <clears throat> Those who use the internet to illegally access and alter data. Medjet is an organization of such people organized by the larger international community. So they operate on a global scale. That makes them even bigger than Kaneshiro. Right? Then it's settled. Our next target's gonna be Mona Mona. I mean Medjid. I wonder what if the Navel get a hit on if we put Medjid in. Oh, right. 
That's impossible. Yes, that name has to be a pseudonym. We don't even know how many people Majed is. Oh! Wouldn't we get at least one member's info? Oh, wait, wouldn't... Oh. Wouldn't we get at least one member's info if we try and look into it, though? You know what, Ryuji? Your thought is as stupid as your words. Even if we did, how would we discover their location? The only confirmed presence of Mejid has been online. This is a greater problem than simply, uh, simply finding their keywords. Unless you have any more ideas, Ryuji. Hello! It seems he had suggested this without putting much thought into it. Come on, we can't back down now! People are all excited about it! Our reputation is going to plummet if we don't face this shit. That is true. If we remain silent, people would believe we simply chose to run away from the matter. Medjid has taunted us publicly after all. If they are criminals, we cannot just let them be. Yeah! And we don't have any other targets right now either. Hey, Akiren! Let's, just, let's talk to Mishima tomorrow. This is more his thing. Is Mishima part of Medjid? <laughs> I doubt that. Also, Makoto, try seeing if your sister has any info on them. It's highly unlikely, but sure. Ugh. I'm blind. I'm blind. If we can change Medjed's heart, it'll most definitely affect Mementos. Yeah, absolutely. Because, you know, Mementos is the world's palace, right? Not just Tokyo's. It's the world. It's just Tokyo. Ba la ba la. Oh, you forgot? What'd you forget? I forgot to post the photo I took. Oh! Oh, that's so cute! I love it! Hey, not bad! Right? I'm a natural with this can candy, f candy photography stuff. I'll hope for your sake that it was intended to be candid photography. It's a shame about the rain, but at least it means today was a little more memorable. Yeah, but next time, we really can't miss the fireworks. Agreed. Still, it was almost impossible. Impressive how swiftly the river, the river turned weatherable. Perhaps one of us is simply... Fated to bring rain wherever he goes. Aww, you talking about yourself? How sad. Yusuke, aww. Uh, yes, actually. Oh, I was gonna wait for a... Damn it. Oh well, I can't, I can't put this off any longer. I was gonna wait for a fortune boost, but... I just, I need the points. If I don't, if I don't start getting the points now... It's gonna be too late. Uh, in the meaner time, so my schedule says I'm supposed to make curry, which yes, I need curry, but, ooh, Thieves Den update. Oh, cause of the photo probably. Oh wait, oh no, I don't think I can call Kawakami. Hey. We have tomorrow to think about, let's call Kawakami another time. No, you're supposed to let me call Kawakami. Ingredients. Make curry. What do you want to do? Yes? Yeah! Okay, cool. Good. I, c I can have Kawakami make the curry. She quit her maid job, but she's my... Uh... We romanced her. That's what it is. Alright, so... Normally... I don't know what okay. normally is. Oh my god, there's so many. So let's try making something else. I, I, maybe. Um, spotlight? What are you? Raises chance of being targeted by foes for an ally. Ah. Then Vanish Ball. Guarantees escape. Not bad. But how about Smoke Screen? We like these. These are good. I have two Go Homes. I don't think I need any more. 
Let's make... Whoa. Oh, whoa. How many? Oh, wait. That's lockpick. Never mind. Here we go. I can make five of this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait. I need... Wait. Yeah, no. Stop. Because just in case... Just in case... I should write something. I need to make sure I get the plus... The, the plus five. I don't know how much... Uh, Proficiency I do need okay. But Okay so we're gonna make A number of smoke screens Yeah I like being not seen yeah. Gonna make five smoke screens You wanna ask Kawakami Well she's already making something else So no Wow Can't believe I can ask Kawakami to do it while she's making curry There's no way that would actually work Alright there's the five yeah! There's the plus five. Nice. Yes. You're definitely getting better. I can tell just by watching you. Yeah. Wait. Nice. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. There's another plus two. Okay. Good. Cause that was a plus three. I was like, where's my plus Okay. Ah. Uh... Oh wait, that's rank four now. Oh, I didn't actually need to do that. Oh, that's fine. I wanted the smoke screens anyway. Because this palace is really hard to sneak through. Or at least it was originally. I had a lot of trouble with it. That doesn't mean it actually is hard. Um, but it's not easy. What? Tell me. Everyone's been talking about Medjed. What the hell is it? You don't watch the news much, do you? They're an international network of hacktivists. They target corporations doing shady business and cause chaos. The subway company server thing? That was Medjid. Trying to find out who caused the train accident. Oh, interesting. So they're good guys? Some liken uh, them no to way. digital Robin Hoods. But they snoop through emails and destroy data. They're no better than criminals. Indeed. Indeedy. Medjid, those guys claim to be modern Robin Hoods. J sure. They dare call themselves heroes after those attacks. Psh. They're fighting Medjid next? The Phantom Thieves are amazing. I don't want to hear about justice from some shady hackers. Why is there hair all over my nose? It itches. I don't care what happened as long as it's interesting. Muzukashi. No, that's difficult. Um. Hey, the grades are out. Oh, our grades are out. How'd you do? Damn, I'm dead. Hey, look at that. Look who got the top score. Oh yeah, I wonder who got it. I'm top of the class. That's amazing! Everyone's gonna have their eyes on you now! Because Morgana is Mario. I mean, he is Morgana. Oh yeah, a most studious disguise. Okay, cool. So, today... Actually, can I do that at night? Oh, but devil... That's right. I have too many nighttime social links now. What the hell? This isn't fair. Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna do a Big Bang Burger today, though. Actually, who's available? Hey! We were busy. It's not like I can focus on studying. Are you sure? I got top of the class. What's your excuse, Ryuji? I got top of the class! Hey, it's not my fault my scores suck, right? Don't get all quiet on me. Yeah, yeah. You think? I got top of the class. Anyways, there's something more important here. Mishima. You want to ask me something about the internet? What? No. Why would you, you know, want that? I'm going to be straight with you here. Do you know who Medjet is? <laughs> you weren't kidding about being direct. Well, I suppose the news about Medjet and the Phantom Thieves has caused quite the commotion. They started out as hackers of justice, but now they only look out for their own bum, bum, bum. interests. That's all I know. They were the group I texted him Wait, about what? yesterday. Wait, what? When did that happen? 
I see. Nobody's sure who actually belongs to Medjet. I know who belongs to Medjet. Me, I am Medjet. Be the Phantom Thieves' world debut, no? Dude. Actually. Don't worry. I'll be rooting for. I do have. I'll get the forum mobilized as well. I do have three suspects as to who the modern day Medjet is. Uh, or, or at least, I, I, I think I know three members who claim to be Medjet. One, Fuka Yamagishi, hacker extraordinaire. Uh, I mean, she's not an extraordinary hacker, but she's a pretty good one. Two, I guess, because I guess. And three, Labrys, because Labrys. Actually, probably not Labrys. You know what? Maybe not, I guess. It's really just Fuka. But there's no reason Igis and Labrys couldn't be part of Medjed. And then maybe Mitsuru? But that's unlikely. Oh, no, no, no. You know who's absolutely a part of Medjed? Baofu. He claims to be done with that kind of thing, but nah. Baofu's definitely part of Medjed. But who's the real Medjed? Who from P1 might be in Medjed? You know what? Because P1 takes place in 1996, I can't say with any kind of certainty that any of them would be. Like, I think the, I think the one in P5, P, P1 that was the most technologically connected, so to speak, would have been Nanjo, but he'd be busy running his company now. Oh well. Now we're done talking here. I really must be going. I'll see you guys later. Asta. Asta la bye bye. So that was fruitless. Not really. I wonder if anyone else got any info. Whish. Mishima was useless. Like a bitch. I tried asking my sister, but she's a bitch and didn't have any info. She doesn't specialize in cybercrime after all. I tried looking them up, but I'm a bitch and didn't find anything. There are really no- just no leads. Hmm. Our opponent is a truly elusive bitch. <laughs> no luck. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to. It was it was such a good joke. I, d I don't care if no one's laughing. <laughs> Medjet, huh? It seems like we won't be able to deal with them by Because we're a bunch of bitches. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> Kawakamer. Vacation is due to begin next week, but I have an unfortunate announcement. We'll be holding an emergency assembly on Monday the what? 25th. Please come to school that Wait, day. Wait, what? Emergency on the 25th? Okay, I have that marked down as a plot day. Uh, but what's happened? Wait. Okay, that's the day before we're allowed into the palace. Oh my jeez. Well, all right. Part of me says, I need a haircut. Part of me says, grow your hair out. I don't know which part of me to listen to. So I have no idea what's going to happen on the 25th. I don't remember what this, oh, what this assembly is supposed to be about. We've had many strange incidents. The psychotic breakdowns, students being dragged into crime <laughs> rings. What? I mean, that wasn't us. What are you talking about? Hence, Principal Kobayakawa has instructed all teachers to caution the student body. Well, this is inconvenient for us too, you know, <laughs> having to find things to warn you about so suddenly. Ah, shit. No, I can't read that without my glasses, damn it! I was hoping it would just be Kawakami talking endlessly.
All right, hang on. Ah, damn it. There, using my headphones as a headband. That works. Uh, but now I have to get my glasses back on. Ah. I need new glasses. There we go. I mean, I, c I could play without my glasses. It would just strain my eyes a little bit more than necessary. How are we gonna find Mejid? I'm not sure. No matter how hard I look online, all I find are rumors about Ryuji the bitch. I, uh, they have carried out corporate terrorism, yet they still manage to elude arrest somehow. Kanishiro was a lot of trouble, but this is turning out to be a much greater ordeal. Did he bite off more than we could chew? I'm not sure. Right. There's no knowing who we're actually up against. If we can't see the full picture, we don't even know whether it's a single individual or a large conglomerate of people. And if we do manage to get a lead, what do we do from there? Damn, this stuff is really not going so good. That's probably why my exams are going to shit. Because I'm a bitch. You know, those two are separate things, right? Inkling! Damn, this stuff's really not going so good. It's the Inkling! And for those who have been watching and or playing the new Final Fantasy VII Remake, it's Jesse! Lindbeck is one of the best VAs. I mean, she doesn't have, like, a huge variety of voices, but she's pretty good. I want her I want her computer set up. Actually, I almost have her computer set up. Almost. It's it's a very close thing. <laughs> I love that laugh. Oh my god. <laughs> if we can't identify who it is, there's nothing we can do. Let's wait till it make a move. All right, so what's that gonna do? <gasps> Caroline, you jerk, you never picked up the- Oh shit, oh shit, oh no! Aw, oh, fuck. Although, you know what we could do? No, we can't. Well, so much for that Lilum. I can try working on a new Lilum. It's okay. God damn it. God damn it. And they didn't remind me so many times. They sent me one text and I'm an ass. I'm a dick. I'm a I hate myself. So Ryuji wants to hang out. I could do a Ryuji. And it looks like Anzu wants to hang out. I could hang out with Anzu. Uh who else wants to hang out? Makoto, but she doesn't want to rank up. Huh. What happened there? Should I have put off uh, the previous rank up? And then who do we have here? Anzu, Takemi. Okay. So... Why is uh, why is uh uh what rank what well, what rank was did I leave her off on? Confidant, she's rank three. Okay, did I have the persona with me? I would assume so. Did I answer everything correctly? I want to assume so. Hmm. Oh no, that's right. That's what happened, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, no. 
I did not answer everything correctly. I answered, I think, the first one correctly because I was looking at the wrong rank up. That's right. That's right. That's my bad. Sorry, Makoto. So, yeah. When is this going to give me points? It's supposed to give me points at some point. Hmm. I must have missed it. Which is annoying. Um. Uh, so I really should rank up my party members. But... I could also... Oh, hey. I just remembered. I don't have Devil yet, do I? Faith, Judge, Sun, Star... Temp, Death. Nope, I do not have Devil. Yikes. But Temperance is maxed! Hee 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 hee. <laughs> I love that laugh. It's such a... I, I don't even know what that laugh is, but I love it. Uh, have I raided the vending machines? I think I raided the important ones. But not that one. I do want to keep a uh, somewhat high... What you What are you guys talking about? It's something new. Hey, about that honor student. I get... I guess that's where she stopped. What? Oh, are they talking about how um how she didn't make it in the in her event thing? Interesting. That's really sad that she didn't make it. Maybe if I had maxed out her social link before the event, maybe then? I don't know. I feel so bad for her. Poor Kasumi. Where was it going? Uh, I think I was heading for Big Bang Burger. Because I have all of the stats necessary for Big Bang Burger to, uh, whatchamacallit, to get to the next rank. And apparently, uh, the Neon Cave, which I, I mention them a lot, so uh, you're welcome for the shoutouts. Not that I have a big enough following for that to matter. Um, apparently they were able to get the third level of Big Bang Challenge in, like, May, I think. That, I think that's crazy. Obviously, they did absolutely nothing but social stats. I think, like, every night was, uh, beef bowl and or, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't even know. 2,000? Oh, my jeez. Well, here we go. Good luck and take a seat. Wait, 2000. Is, is that the medium Thank one? No, it, it should be the... Please do your best to complete your second mate. Now then. Well then, it's time to get the 30 minute Big Bang Challenge started. Ready, go! I thought I did this one. It's such meaty proportions. Don't get hasty. I somehow ate the whole thing. Hell yeah. Ooh, you, you've done it again! Look at those two. Congratulations. Congratulations on your challenge. Oops. The first mate badge. Hell yeah. And to the Burger Baron who defeated this challenge, we present to you our world famous Big Bang Burger on the house. We hope you enjoyed the taste of victory. Victory! Five big bangs! Enjoy your new rank, first mate. However, one mission still remains. Please come again. I look forward to your next attempt. Aw, oh, fuck. I knew you could do it. So... Now I need to do the actual big bang? <laughs> no! Are you kidding? How did I end up not doing this one? Well, all right. So there's plus three to everything. Huh. Weird. Yeah, that one absolutely should have already been done. It's nice to get those uh, staff boosts, but it should have been the plus five. Uh, you're back. Summer break soon, right? Wait, how do, what is what is his voice? Summer break soon, right? 
Must be nice being a student. So I looked into Medjid. Did you find anything? As you know, Medjid is a god that appears in Egyptian Book of the Dead. Ha! Its name apparently means the Smiter. It seems nobody is actually sure that Medjid is a real name. On top of that, almost everything else about him is unknown. Even his forum is unattainable. Eh! Oh, 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 his form, I guess. An unseen god that flies through the sky and shoots from his eyes. What the fuck? He truly is an elusive being. Yusuke! Dude, yeah. Everything about his existence is shrouded in mystery. Wait! Fundamentally speaking, ancient... However, Medjid, tracking all info, I see. I hope that is indeed it was. Should I look into more? That's enough. Thank you. <laughs> so we Dial. Still don't have any tangible clues. Wow. Who's talking to? I feel really, really bad for Oya. I don't. I don't want to leave her hanging this long. What rank is she now? She should be rank 3, right? And she needs a hangout. Because her last rank didn't give us any points. So... Huh. I could start Oya. Uh, where's the church? There's the church. Ah, Hifumi is available! Huh, what should I do? I'm supposed to be doing a devil tonight. Oh no, I still haven't started EY. Uh. Alright, well. So. Hmm. I suppose, perhaps. Uh. After... Perhaps after the palace, we start... Oh, oh wait. EY, I'm not actually supposed to have started until uh, the 27th. Fortune needs a hangout, though. When was I supposed to hang out with Fortune? I was supposed to have that on here somewhere. Oh! Oh, I see. Yeah. I'm gonna... That makes sense. And that'll be fun to show off. Okay, so then I guess tonight we do devil. Because I need devil to devil and more devil. Oh, that's right. Calling card and boss is at the same time. Okay. Okay, cool. So that, that's nice. Um, and I think... I kind of want to slip a... Uh, I, well, if I was going to do a mementos, it would have been tonight. So, no. Uh, sometime after the... Oh, there's another faith. Mm, should I cut out the movie? I can probably cut out the movie. No, I should keep the movie. No, I should cut it out. No, I should keep it. No, I should cut it out. I don't know what to do. I should get to the plot. Um, so, we're going to hang out with Devil. Cause I like her. She cool. She won my faves. Oh, honey. Oh, you're here again, boy. Don't blame me if you get eaten alive, okay? I love Lala John. Oh yeah, Ichiko exists. Hey, where's my glass? Didn't I order a refill? How much did I drink today? What time is it? Uh, who cares? Wait, I care. She's so drunk, she hasn't even noticed you're here. If we have her write articles, it'll have an effect on the metaverse. We might be able to use her if we do it right. Should we try to form a deal with Oh Yeah? Oh Yeah! Form a deal. Now then. Keep in mind that she's drunk. Now do a good job in negotiating, okay? Okay. Okay. Dick. Hey, Lala-chan, are you sure this is 
isn't just oh yeah, water? it's voice because it's rank one. If you're trying to rip me off, I'm gonna reveal all your secrets in a feature article. <coughs> oh, it's you! Yeah. Please have a seat. So, what's up? Got anything new on the Phantom Thieves? Or maybe you're just falling in love with me, hmm? Absolutely. That too. That too? So then, you do have news on the Phantom Thieves? Thank God. My publisher just assigned me to be the beat reporter for the Phantom Thieves. Man, this will really help me out. Are you seriously going to use this child as a source of information? Sure, why not? Ah, oh, don't be such a killjoy. These kids nowadays know about things we adults don't have access to. Besides, what's most important is that I now have a reliable third-party source for my stories. <laughs> so, what do you want from me this time? Information about someone? Cold hard cash? I want your body. I'll let you know later. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Lucky me! My very own golden goose just appeared. Now I can take it easy. Maybe I'll take a little vacation with all my friends. Hell yeah! Take that vacation with me As on our honeymoon. Oh wants, yeah! Just tell me. Last time it was info on Kanishiro, right? Well, he got arrested soon after. So don't think that I can't and put two and two together. Bah. There we go. Something's. <gasps> she knows. The bad guys are bad. <laughs> <laughs> so you're being swayed by the phantom thieves, huh? But I see what's going on here. Hardcore wow. thieves Wow. Bad answer. Huh. Hey, I'm not gonna let you use this kid so you can take a vacation. A vacation? Oh, <laughs> I was just kidding. I'm conducting a private investigation during my off hours. No one at work knows oh. about it. Don't tell me you're... Hey, how about we do this? You supply me with info on the Phantom Thieves, and I'll write articles based on what you tell me about them. You know, the Phantom Thieves who you love oh so much. Deal? Deal. We can do that. Very good. We can we can deal good. Good deal. Sounds great. All right then. It's a deal. I can create a lot of positive PR for the Phantom Thieves, so be sure to give me some good scoops. Absolutely. I made a deal with, oh yeah. What are you gonna say about my devil contract? Yes, I made a deal with the devil, deal with it. Your reputation skyrocketed after a certain point. It's unnatural how much your actions I told you I made a deal with the devil. Did you have an inside man in the media? Someone who could manipulate him No, I made a deal with the devil. What do you have? I made a deal with the devil. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the devil, See? Persona, See? The winds of blessing that I made a deal with the devil. La, la diable. Devil rank one. Rumor field scoop. Decrease security level when you find a new safe room. Oh, interesting. That's cool. Right. But only when you find a new one. I feel like they they uh altered how her how her abilities work a little bit. Fusing personas of the devil will gain you XP for the devil arcana persona. Oh, don't tell anyone about this. What? Okay? I don't want people Why? to source as a high schooler. Okay, Lala Chan. Time to celebrate our agreement. My bottle. <laughs> Two glasses, please. Oh my god. Oh, come on. 
on, please. Whoa, her silence is. I love Lala John. Fine, fine, fine. I won't make the high school. <laughs> oh, I gotta use the bathroom. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's in there for a while. You should go home. <laughs> I was able to pique Oya's interest. I feel like my charm has increased, which I will need soon enough. I need to max out my charm, which is actually a little behind. But that's fine. That's fine. So is my my uh what who my Makoto, because I need to max out Makoto or uh. I need to max out Charm to get Makoto rank 6. So that's gonna have to wait until then. You take care oh! Now. Oh, I never realized that Lala's Chan was wearing a kimono. Oh, that's so cool. I love her. Alright, you be careful on your way home. Don't stick around Shinjuku too long after dark, honey. We get a lot of shady types coming around the woodwork. Lala Chan, where'd you go? I want my booze, Lala Chan. Honestly, that lady's gonna be the death of me. You'd better head home. If she catches you, you're in all you're in for an all nighter. Sounds like a good time. Hell yeah! Careful now. If you play with fire, you'll get burned. Well, I better get back inside. Come again. You'll always be welcome here. But head straight home tonight, okay? I don't know if I'm doing Lala Chen's voice justice, but. Ba la la ba la la ba la la la. Ba ba la la ba la la ba la la ba la la la. Oh, you know what? Seems you've got your share of problems, inmate. What? What are you talking about, Caroline? To think you would relax under such circumstances. Either you're quite bold or quite foolish. What? What are you talking about, Justine? One with an unseen form. Hmm. It seems you've been targeted by troublesome. What? Enemies. What are you talking about, Igor? It's big news. <laughs> I've been enjoying this endless dispute over justice. justice. However, it will soon come to an end, and through the appearance of an unexpected force of all things. I should do a super clip of every single time a character says the word justice. I should do that. I, I should totally do that. Hell yeah, I'm going to do that. Engaging with formidable enemies is also part that will of require a second playthrough. I ask that you overcome this. After all, you must hone your powers and become a magnificent thief. It's really summer now. I get sweaty just walking a little bit. That's nice. I didn't think Medjed would pounce on the Phantom Thieves. Interesting things keep happening this year. The influence of the Phantom Thieves <laughs> has no bounds. Influence I of Seshu Masters. It, honestly, I wonder what the public thinks of this. Speaking of Master, I miss Mr. Bates. Or perhaps inconvenienced. Bates Sama, come back. I miss you. Or perhaps inconvenience? Entertain. Entertained, huh? A luxury for the uninvolved. I know they mean no ill intent. So this is what the public thinks. Oops. Mm. I don't have time for a conversation. My attendance has been poor due to interviews lately. Thank you for your valuable opinion. I'll see you around. I don't get it. Oh no, I got distracted by the music. I was trying to analyze the sounds. 
Ah, I'm an idiot. Okay. <clears throat> there hasn't been any news on the Phantom Thieves versus Majid showdown. Which of them will come out on top? They're both just criminals pretending to be heroes. If you ask me, Majid causes way more trouble. They attack- AS HER! They attack every company they set their sights on. I see. Well, I hope some something happens soon. But you gotta tell me, who do you think will win? I forgot, I need to go talk to, to Yandere Chan. Hey, your phone was buzzing earlier. It was? I've gotten a lot of messages from an unknown account. Ooh. Morgana, when did you get your own account? What is this? I don't have a way to, hang on a minute. That's probably a bad idea. Ugh, yeah, that's a bad idea. Huh. Ugh. Rotten milk milks the tip of black. Wow 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 wow. Oh wow 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 wow. How's that? How's that for a distortion? Actually, should it be more like no, it would have to be Something like this, perhaps. Yeah. <clears throat> nice to meet you. <laughs> I'm the one called Alibaba. I want to ask you something. You're a phantom thief, aren't you? Can you really steal hearts? Who is this? Why does he know that you're a phantom thief? Was one of our teammates pulling a prank on you? There is someone I want you to steal. Wait. There's someone whose heart I want you to steal. But I'm not asking for charity. Let's make a deal. You wish to know about Medjet, correct? I can give you information on them. But if... But it... Mm, on them... If the change of heart is successful, if you so desire, I can take care of them as well. Do you believe in my skills? I can track down their accounts, just as I have with yours. But this is all I can prove at the moment. I've prepared the necessary tool on my end. I look forward to it. Shouldn't you respond to it? How should I respond? Is this a prank? Is this a prank? I can't find the account to send a response to. All I get back is an error message. Hmm? You can't reply back. So it seems. I don't know what this is all about, but we should probably let everyone know about this. I don't know if this bottle actually does what I'm what I want it to do. Is the bottle doing what I want it to do? Is it is it giving me some kind of reverb? Probably not. Medjid must be bored. Both are crossing the line. Shady shit ain't justice. Internet showdown? Whoa! Medjid is dangerous. Criminal catfight, eh? Nice. Yeah, yeah, it's all a setup. Justice this, justice that. Hang in there, you guys. Ooh. They're gonna do it, right? Toto some um, what? Histories, written by the winner. Medjid here, lol. It's just like a catchy set. Ah. Uh, wh wow. Wow, there's people from all across the world going to the website now. That's crazy. Medjid, what's happening in the country? It'd be hilarious if the honor student fell off the podium. 
How dare! Is it over for the Phantom Thieves? Hacking. I have no idea what it's like, but it sounds scary. Think they were getting a little cocky? They got what was coming for them. Considering he mentioned stealing hearts, he knows, doesn't he? Probably. Seems so. How were we found out? Because hacker? He may have traced our chat box. Yes, because hacker. How careless of us. But how would he have known all these details with just that? Do you think that there is another cause? Yeah. Maybe somewhere is bugged? Sure why, but that's the Welcome I back, Bloodboard. I uh, hey, kind of didn't notice you were gone. I'm sorry. I don't know much about it myself. I noticed you were quiet. I didn't. I didn't realize you were gone. Possible, I think. How's it done? Maybe they extracted our phone's data. Probably. Why is he getting an error when he tries? Because the apply? server doesn't exist. Perhaps the receiving end doesn't <laughs> exist. That's possible. Don't ask me everything. I told you that I don't know much about it. Wait, might this be what is referred to as hacking? Then does that mean this guy's a hacker? Wow, you guys are so slow. What does this all mean? An unknown hacker contacted us. I see. Do you? I don't really Oh my get god. It. Then is this person measured? I doubt it. Considering he says he wants to deal with them. That is, only if we take his words for face value. True. Hey, wouldn't it be great mm. if we got this guy on our side? But we know nothing about his... Bill, you in on what happened. We can't trust him. Well, when did you leave? What was the last thing you remember, Bloodborne? Because a lot has happened. We, we made a deal with the devil. Uh, we went to the fireworks. Uh, we made some tools, had Kawa Curry make some curry. Uh, we did a Big Bang challenge that I feel like I should have already had done. Uh, what else? What else did we do? Uh, we got threatened by Medjed. And then now some unknown hacker has contacted us saying, I will deal with Medjid for you if you do a thing for me. Steal a heart that I tell you to steal. This mysterious cat-faced hacker has told us they want us to target a person. And now we're trying to figure out whether or not to trust this unknown Alibaba. I don't think it's a bad deal though. Even if Alibaba turns out to be a criminal, I am not helping anyone of that sort. Oh, right. That wouldn't be good. The I've prepared the necessary tool part makes no sense either. Calling card. Could this just be a prank? He knows an awful lot for it to be a prank. If he knows who we are, won't we get caught? No. No, but if he wanted to report us, I think he would have done it already. He must have some sort of objective of his own. He did offer us a deal after all. I'm certain he'll contact us again. There's no telling when he'll do so, though. It'd be best if we stay together. If something happens, we can act at once. Yeah, so somewhere we can wait and hide for long hours. How about LeBlanc? Yeah! Home base is now home! Oh, is this the first time? Wait, what is that? Oh, <laughs> what's with the big group? Good what evening. is that? We were thinking about putting together plans for our summer. Hmm, is that a new face I see? It's nice to meet you. My name is Makoto Nijima. I'm <coughs> not being a bother. <coughs> that is going to be a lot to him. President Nijima. Is something wrong? No, no. No. It's, it's just not. that you're. <clears throat> nah, nah, it's nothing. 
It's just that your sister keeps hounding me for uh, child abuse or something or other. I don't know. I feel like some woman that I may or may not have had relations with in the past may be uh, trying to blackmail me. And, you know, you know, it's just, it's nothing. Your, your sister comes here a lot. And she's, she's kind of a, uh, you know, you sense flirting? Well, of course you sense flirting. Sojiro is a flirt. And, great thing for him, <clears throat> Makoto is not jailbait. She is 18 and fully legal. And ready to mingle. Student council president, eh? I'm stunned. I hope he's not causing you too much trouble. I'm Sojiro Sakura, but everyone just calls me boss. I'm By Sojiro way, Sakura. That was addressed to you. Uh, this old man will get going and leave you kids be. All right, the store's all yours. We have late breaking news on Medjit, whose notoriety rose since <gasps> their statement the other day. They have takoyaki. Yusuke, give me your takoyaki. And they have Jagardiko. Moments ago, a new message has been released on their website. They have announced their victory what? over what the Phantom Thieves. What is Jagardiko? Medjit I need also to know. warns any Japanese citizens who praised the Phantom Thieves to stop doing so. We will report any further actions by Medjit as they arrive. Oh, come on. It's in English. Let me see. The Phantom Thieves remain silent at our question. This proves that we are just. People of Japan, wake up. You must not worship the Phantom Thieves. Huh. What? That's bullshit! Keep listening. We will discipline any who worship them. The punishment is the confiscation of possessions. Bum, bum, bum. We are Medjed. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. That's what it says. What does that all mean? They're saying that they'll target sympathizers of the Phantom Thieves. Confiscation of possessions, hmm? Perhaps bank accounts or personal information? Either way, it won't be anything pleasant. Why the hell are we being singled out? Perhaps all they care about is labeling the Phantom Thieves as crooks. That all this wouldn't have happened had the Phantom Thieves not existed. That's complete bullshit! Talk about a troublesome organization that we've been targeted by. Isn't there anything we can do? It certainly can't do anything about this on our own. Hey, so what's this letter about? No need any more trouble. It's rare for you to get something like this. A calling card? Why? Who's gonna steal our hearts? Okay, so I found out... Or, yeah, I found I found out what the Jagariko is. It was actually really easy. Um, now where's the picture? Oh, wait! Ah, there it is. So apparently, this is Jagariko, and it's like it's like if you had a potato chip, but it was a French fry. So it's rather interesting concept, and I do know that they are extremely popular in Japan. So that's Jagariko, and now I know. So that's cool. A calling card? Anything else in there? Who's this from, anyway? There's no stamp on it. Is it blank? Someone must have directly dropped it into <gasps> the box. They know where we live. Could it have been Alibaba? Okay. One, that is a PlayStation Vita. Two. What do you want to bet that manga is Makoto's? Ah! And Makoto has Starvix. I love it. Or at least I, I, I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be Starvix. There's stars on the cup. It's a Starvix coffee. Yeah, that's the same manga that Makoto was stalking us with. And, dude, the fact that there's a Vita there is amazing. I like that Atlas acknowledges... Hey, Stalker. 
Oh, right, right, because they, they slipped the thing directly into the mailbox. Yeah. Could it have been Alibaba? That reminds me. He did mention something about preparing the necessary tool. Don't tell me. Is this what he was talking about? What the hell's going on here? All we can do at the moment is wait for Alibaba's orders. Let's brace ourselves and stand by. In case anything comes up. Oh dear. Oh dear indeed. I just noticed that Anzu had chocolate next to her. She was the only one with the chocolate. Oh, <clears throat> uh, shoot. What was my Mishima voice? <clears throat> Yoda I am. Really started turning up the heat I have. A special post in everything I put up. Okay, I'm done with that. <laughs> um, the showdown between the just phantom thieves and the global organization Medjet is here. Reactions have been great too. Everyone is really engaged. So far, the comments have been pro Phantom Thieves. Most likely because of what happened in the Kanashiro case. Those on the other side say Medjid are hackers of justice. But there's nothing resembling justice in what they do. Someday, I want the whole site to be filled with pro thief comments. I'm looking forward to when that day finally arrives and I'm no longer your bitch. He can look forward to whatever he wants. We have no means of striking back against Medjid. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Magrana's response there was amazing. We're gonna be in deep trouble if we don't do something. First that Alibaba character, and now a blank calling card. What the hell is going on? I don't know, kitty kitty. I don't know. Uh, it is a Wednesday, which means it is a curry day. However, can I go anywhere? No, I cannot. Um, I guess I'm going to make curry. So, I'm going to have Kawakami make coffee. So we'll, let's call Kawa Coffee. Yep. Hi. Hi, honey, I'm home. All right, cool. And then, and then what? I'm gonna check the DVD. Oh, I don't think I've read any of it, watched any of it. Uh. Better to do the curry. Because curry days are limited and I can watch the DVD whenever. And I'm stuck on a plot train, so I'll be able to do all kinds of stuff while I'm stuck in Leblon. Hmm. You learned how to make curry from the chief. Wait, what? Hmm. It looks like Kawakami using... No! Oh, that's bullshit. You can't have her make coffee while you make curry? Oh, that's so stupid. All right. Well, shit. I fucked that up. Uh, I... Mm, I guess we watched the movie. Let's watch the DVD. Craft it up. What the hell are you doing here? Ah, <laughs> it's prison break. That's right. Come on, let's get you out of here. Do you? Does anyone watching this remember Prison Break? That show on, uh, I think it was Fox. That's, that is, an amazing reference. It's not exactly obscure, but it's not something you would expect to be referenced here. That's, that's really cool. It's a story about a man who went to prison for his older brother, but now he's trying to escape. Well, that's, that's actually why he went to prison, is so that they could escape. And then what was it? The main character, Schofield, he, uh, he actually was part of the, uh, architect? No. It wasn't the architect. 
anyway, he had the blueprints for the prison because he helped to build it. And because of that, he was able to uh, make, like, three different plans on how to escape. Unfortunately, he was unable to escape with just him and his brother because he needed help from, like, five other prisoners. And ended up helping them escape as well. And then the plot got really complicated, and I think they were just throwing stuff at the wall at that point? I don't know. It got weird. The protagonist used all sorts of skills to escape from prison. Maybe you learned a thing or two about prison breaking. Thanks to the craft of cinema, I enjoyed it at a deeper level. Hmm. Plus five. Max out, max out? No, of course not. Why Why would it max out? <laughs> well, it's starting to get late. Let's head to bed soon. Okie dokie. Thank you for waiting. Here you go. Kawa coffee. All right. I'll see you later. See you at school tomorrow. Don't be late. I just want to imagine that every time you call Kawakami over, uh, you, uh, you, uh, ha have us some time with her, uh, in, in your bedroom. Uh, cause, like, she'd be pretty pissed if all you did was call her over just to make coffee, just to make, do your laundry, just to make curry or, or lock picks. Like, yeah, she's happy to help you no matter what, but... I mean, she's got to get something out of the deal, right? And you are romanced, so why not? Now, on the not romance side, because the feelings are a little different there, she's more like your mother at that point. Uh, I feel like... I feel like she's just doing it because she sees you as a helpless son. By the way, Kawakami is old enough to be your mother. Well, at least he, she's old enough to be Joker's mother. Why haven't the Phantom Thieves said anything? Having your money, money stolen sounds terrifying. It's unsettling not knowing what they're going to do to us. They're declaring victory? What does that mean? I really wish they'd stop that. Every time I go high-pitched. Good morning. Well, according to Joker, that's the best part. Personally, I don't know. I never had any feelings for any of my teachers. It's Kasumi! Good morning, senpai! Every day is so hot. I empty my water bottle so fast. By the way... Summer break's coming up. Could I ask what your plans are, senpai? <clears throat> My plans are you, babe. My plans are you. I want her to join in on all the festivities that we get up to, but she's not a member of the Phantom Thieves. Kasumi, I need you to be a member of the Phantom Thieves. What about you, sweet cheeks? So, anyway. Uh, okay. Odd... Uh, Odd use of a voice clip, but, uh... <clears throat> I'll be mostly training with the gymnastics team. And if I have free time, I'll be doing self-training. Or, would you like to join me, senpai? Whenever you're available would be fine. In other words, she's saying she'll be available during summer break. To social link. Unlike... Okay, that's, that's actually rather interesting. So, Persona 3, which is where social linking started. Um... Social links that were tied to the school were unavailable during summer break. There were a number of social links that you start outside of the school, and those were always available. And then in Persona 4, they made it a little bit easier in that your party member social links were available outside of school on holidays. Uh, but only if a holiday was on a certain day. I think all of them had Sundays. And then 
some of them would have uh, specific other days of the week that they were also available. But because here, none of the party members, aside from Makoto to an extent, are associated with a club. Uh, and they're focusing wholeheartedly on being a phantom thief. They're available to Social Link whenever. Whenever they would normally be available in or out of school, they're available. Um, yeah, they're actually the only Social Link that would be tied to the school would be Maruki. But we'll see if he actually makes himself available outside of school. Yes, Bloodborne. That, yeah. If if you're dating a a a coworker or uh, someone at school, it can get awkward if you break up. Uh, and that's one reason people might find a new place to work, or um, you know, I at school it's probably not as bad because while yeah, you'd still have classes with them. You'd be focusing more on the on the class, theoretically. And so it would be easy enough to just ignore them. But if one or the other tries to uh, make a big deal out of it, that could get awkward. Personally, I've never had that issue. Um... Yeah. Yeah, it's a thing. That, that, that could be a thing. Oh, the train's almost here. Kasumi wants to get on. Hey, your phone's buzzing. Th thanks, Morgana. Why are you telling me this now when you don't tell me when it's the Phantom Thieves? Or does he tell me when it's the Phantom Thieves and we just haven't heard it? But yeah, this is Ryuji. What the hell, Morgano? Uh, it's just Ryuji. I like that. My response was basically the same. Ah, it's Ryuji. Kawakami. Ryuji again. You shut up. You're. You don't make these com. Oh. Oh no. Hang on a minute. <clears throat> Are you ready for this? Good day! Good day! Who is this? Ah, you responded today! Once again, I'm Alibaba! You are the leader of the Phantom Thieves, correct? How are you... How are you know? You got the wrong guy. No, I know I'm right. I take it you received the calling card. So it really was from this guy. Are you at school right now? Nope. <laughs> Are you cutting class? That's not good, you know. Now then, I've prepared the calling card for you. When are you going to steal it? What are you talking about? Hmm? Stealing a heart, of course. Aren't you going to steal a heart as long as you have a calling card? Tell him. We need the name of the target. I need a name. A name? Is your heart thievery truly impossible without such information? Just tell me. I see. Huh. I suppose past calling cards did have names on them. One moment. Very well, I'll tell you. I believe their name was Futaba Sakura. If you fail in this mission, I will explo explode your identity to the world and the police. 
Well then, I'll be counting on you. We shall... I, we shall speak again after the change of heart. Who is Futaba Sakura? No answer. I can't find the account to send a response to. All I get back is an error message. Error 404. Subject not found. So he threatened you, then just took off? Apparently. Sakura? I feel like I've heard that mm, name before. Sojiro Sakura? In any case, we should let everyone know about this. We have to steal Futaba's heart! Oh no! Why must we- Why are we here again? We're gonna get reported if we don't do this? What the hell? Futaba Sakura? Wasn't Sakura- Boss's name? Yes. Why is Boss's last name? Does he have any family? Who knows? Does he? I don't know. He's got a lot of girls on the back burner. How way back are you? Wouldn't you normally be introduced at least? I mean, you are living Yes, at place. his store, not his house. Well, his situation does make things difficult. Calling card was delivered to Boss's house. It'd be more natural to assume this is all related. One of the reasons for that is because Alibaba mentioned nothing about which Futaba Sakura. Perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough. That makes sense. I believe it's adequate for us to think that this is the doing of someone close by. But who? And why? I don't know how Alibaba got a hold of his smartphone information. However, since he's ordering us through chat, I do feel as though he's taunting us. You mean... This might just be a prank? I mean, look at his demands. Pay me if you don't want me to leak who you really are. That I'd understand. But he's telling us to steal someone's heart without explaining why. So we're being tested. Apparently. Regardless, I think we should ask Boss about Futaba Sakura once. That's probably for the best. There's nothing else we can do at the moment, and Chief might have an idea on what this is about too. Possibly. I'll check the school's roster. Just no, that's case. not gonna work. We must make sure Boss doesn't figure out who we uh, are. <laughs> have to go about that. <laughs> yeah, about that. This is the beginning of Boss finding out. I kind of love that they all call him Boss because it's a Catherine reference. Catherine is another Atlas game. I just realized the TV that we always look at is a big, is a flat screen. I don't know why, but I thought it was a CRT. Huh. Um, and I don't think the boss in Catherine is the same voice as Sojiro, but Sojiro is, or his voice actor, I forget his name, his voice actor is in Catherine. Uh, as, I guess, kind of the narrator? Who is Futaba Sakura? Why do you know about that? Hmm, <sighs> indeed. It's got nothing to do with you. Why not? I'm going home. Make sure you lock Ah, oh, suspicious! I got it! Sojiro is Alibaba! <laughs> and now we're gonna get a call from Alibaba saying... Uh, something, I don't know. Pee 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 pee! Oh, I just remembered! Akiren, were you able to ask boss about Futaba Sakura? He didn't want to talk. Could there be a reason as to why that was? Mmm, Alibaba might be our only hope of defeating Majed. I wish we could get some info about Futaba out of the boss. But trying to force it would probably have the opposite effect. To be honest, I owe a great deal to both boss and Akiren. I don't wish for this to be a source of discord between them. Yeah, I know what you mean, Belch. <laughs> I don't know why I had Ryuji belts, but... It's probably best to, to wait for Boss 
to bring the subject up with him. Wait, what? Oh, wait for... For Sojiro to talk to me about it. Cool. Right, so... Because I, uh... Messed that up. Have Kawakami make some more coffee, so we're call we're gonna call in Kawa Coffee and watch the rest of that DVD because I can't make curry on Thursday. It has to be on Friday, and then I can make curry on uh, Sunday and Monday. So it's probably good to get this out of the way now. Watch the DVD. Watch the jailbreak. Prison break, jailbreak, same thing. Damn it, they're onto us. We're out of time. Wait, just wait. Look at my back. See the map? If we take this route instead, <laughs> we might stand a chance. <laughs> oh, it's such a detailed reference because Schofield had the blueprints tattooed, uh, uh, encrypted into a tattoo on his, onto his, well, his entire body, but. Uh, his back had the main, uh, part that they needed. Wow. <laughs> That's incredible. Pursuing the, pursuing the guard is, and making small gadgets, how did they think of all that? By being clever. So we Whoa. finished watching it, your proficiency went up. Oh, <gasps> sparkles! Is this it? Hmm. Ah, damn! The rumor has killed me. It does not work that way. Let's return okay. the DVD as soon as we can. Well, now let's head to bed. What? What? Wow. Hi. Thank you for waiting. Here you go. It's a fluffy. Say hi, beef. Uh, stop it. Stop it! What are you doing? Beef. First off, you're being a butt. Hi. Butthead. My beefy is a butt. He just wants me to hold him. Hi, don't bump the mic. Don't climb on my shoulder. Thank you for waiting. Here you go, LeBlanc cough. It's a Kawa coffee, all right? See you later. You happy now? Yeah, he's happy now. He's a brat, but he's happy. Tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but ugh, we still got all this lame shit. Oh wow, shit summer break up. already? If you don't take care of this lame shit, you can kiss your summer vacation goodbye. Oh yeah, about this Futaba Saga. What about girl. her? If she's related to Boss, think people living nearby would know about her? Possibly. That's some keen intuition coming from you, Ryuji. You should have made use of that right? in your exams. Uh, I never want to think about it. Well, too bad you have like again. six more. Anyway, Four more, I guess. Asking around in your neighborhood might be the fastest way to figure this shit out. And again, I doubt it'll be that easy. It never is. <laughs> Summer vacation starts the day after tomorrow. But don't forget, there's an urgent assembly on Monday. We'll be taking attendance. Yeah, I'm gonna be speaking loud. Deal with it. There's been an unusual number. Yes, I'm loud. I'm sorry. Deal with it. Don't do anything stupid over break. Got it? Don't go someplace shady, like the Red Light District. Don't go to the beach after dark. Well, you're the one that wanted to be picked up, and you knew I was going to be speaking loudly. So don't get mad. No, I just told you don't get mad. Stupid cat. No. 
If you want to be up here, you have to deal with my voice acting. If you don't want to deal with my voice acting, you can't be up here. I don't care how Sundere you try to act. <sighs> Cats are buttheads. Uh, beach after dark. Light, light red dist. I want to go to the beach. I want to jump in the water. Are you sure you're a cat? <sighs> Seems like we won't be having fun on our summer break. Why not red light district? Bloodborne, you do know what a red light district is, right? What? You're just gonna get upset and run away again. Ah, I see. Um, I don't know if if I'm really the one that should explain it. Uh, or rather, I don't know if I'll do a really good job of it. Um, I guess one way to look at it is it's the shady part of town. Uh, but but for a for a large city, uh, it's usually where all the clubs and or bars are. Um, and, uh, you, you can usually get into a lot of illicit activities. Um, specifically, uh, paid services, so to speak. I mean, it's a rated M game that has made rather, ex um, explicit references to sex, but, uh, yeah, that. See, we won't be having fun for a while. Ryuji might, might be right. We don't have a lot of, uh, a single clue. Might as well try. Let's go get nothing to lose. Let's head to Yongin and gather information at the at the neighborhood. Damn it. Futaba, Futaba, yes. I know that name. Heard it somewhere before. Uh, yes. That was the name of the teacher I had a crush on back when I was in elementary school. Wow. Let's ask some other people. Yeah. Let's. Sakura san's single, right? I thought he had. He didn't have any children. Let's ask other people. Who would know Sakura Futaba? Hey, did you want to listen in? Do you think the Phantom Thieves are a danger to society? Send us your opinions by email or fax. What's the rubbish about Phantom Thieves? They're not real. Well, all right. How about you? Futaba? Who knows? By the way, do you eat a lot? What are you talking about? What? Okay, come here. Come here. But you're not allowed to get mad when I start voice acting, okay? God damn it. My PSP fell. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Uh. Well, whenever boss buys food, it's enough for three to feed three people. Whoa. What? You're telling me you don't actually eat that much? Maybe it's boss who eats a lot then. Let's ask some other people, too. No. You're gonna deal with this, Beef. You're the one who wanted me to hold. No. No, you gotta stay here now. You're stuck. Wise old man. Futaba? Who's that? I don't think I know anybody by that name. 
Hmm? But wouldn't this Futaba get angry if they find out you're snooping on them? Though, let's ask someone else. No. No. You can't just be mad when I don't hold you and then want to leave when I'm talking. No. No. Now you get to be held by it like a baby because you're being a baby. No beef. No. You're being a baby. So now you're going to be held like one. No. 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 You're going to be a baby. See, you don't actually want to be held. Rat. You know, if I'm holding you like this, how am I supposed to play, huh? Go away. And stop yelling at me. Stopping a butt. Alright, now we gotta talk to Delivery Dude, because he'll actually know. Futaba? Hmm. Nope, don't know anyone like that. What are you talking about? I come to Sakura Sounds often to make deliveries, but I've never seen who you're talking about. Let's ask someone else. God. It's a kitty kitty. Ah, no, I wanna look at the kitty kitty. Oh, well. So, wait, who else are we supposed to talk to? Talk to you. Oh, I haven't talked to you. Futaba, no, no, I don't know who that could be. So, up until now, our biggest lead seems to be... The chief buys a lot of food. Far more than enough for one person living alone. Let's check out all the shops where you can buy food. I can buy food here. Probably. This place is close to LeBlanc, so we might be able to learn something here. Hey there, welcome. Hmm, Futaba? Over at Sakura-san's? I haven't heard anything. Uh, sorry. Come again. Hmm. We didn't find anything on Oh Futaba. no, we found the nothing. The only option now is to go home and ask the chief directly. So it seems. Hello, Sai. What up? You read the letter, did you not? So you're the one who tipped <gasps> off about- Sai, how dare! You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you Who's about- Who's Wakaba? Am I Wakaba? Tipped off? What are you talking about? Back to the matter at hand. What is going on here? Your parental authority will have parental? to be suspended. Parental? I take it you're okay with that outcome? But where am I gonna go? What? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points in your favor. Wait, daughter? I'm a son! Wait, daughter? Would you like to take this to domestic- Damn! Life? Our chances of victory are roughly 99.9%. What the hell, Sai? I mean, I get it, you're a prosecutor, but seriously. You... I mean, I guess she really thinks she has a case, but... I doubt she really thinks that she's on the side of justice here. With these suspicions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. God, Sai, why are you being such a bitch? Like, I was I was using bitch as a joke earlier, but seriously, Sai is really acting like a bitch here. You're going that far? I told you I don't know a damn thing about it. Damn. We're extremely serious about this. Her cool, venomous calmness. And Sojiro's outrageous yelling! That's not exactly like it. But as long as there's a possibility that cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns. The what now? That's not how you spell science. Fine. You also, win. it really shouldn't be an I, it should be a Y. Thank you. I will contact no! you at a later date. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. That's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will just be for a nice cup of coffee. Sure. I hope the next time she actually comes here is after 
the opening scenario. <laughs> wow. Soji pissed. That woman is real good at pissing people off. What's with that look? You got something to say? Custody? This doesn't Why not? You. I mean in your costs. Is Futaba your daughter? That's enough. But I want to poke the bear some more. Just behave yourself. And keep going to school if you don't want No, to I want to poke the bear some more. You got that? Let me poke the bear. Papa Bear Sojiro, I need to poke you. But seriously. Well, that basically confirms Futaba exists at least. But it sounds like she's got her own problems. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive? Cognitive something? science. I wonder what the chief. He's hiding are. research about shadows. We can't really press him on the subject, though, especially after he mentioned throwing you out. That's fine. We can investigate without the chief. Pee 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 poo. Yo, how'd it go? You find anything out about Sakura? I mean Futaba? I mean Futaba Sakura? I've been wondering about that too. At the hideout, okay? Uh, sure. Whoa! So did you learn something? Oh, wait, so you did learn something. Fine work. I knew we could count on you. Aki Rancoon, thank you. All right, then let us all meet up at meet up tomorrow. Alright, so I finished the book. Uh, hmm. You know. Maybe. So I can't actually have Kawakami do anything in the kitchen. I can't even have her make coffee, which sucks. And uh, since I cannot leave, I need her to do something. I love that she's free now. It costs absolutely nothing. So I'm going to have her make some tools. What should I have her make? Okay. You know what? Let's have her make some go homes. Yeah. Go homes are nice to have. Or calming aroma. A tonic that calms an enemy's nerves, lowering the palace's security. Because I have nine smoke screens. That's more than enough. Calming aroma. Yeah, I like that. We'll make five of those. Yeah. Let's call Kawakami. She is an amateur, so don't expect too much. So in other words, she'll just she'll make half of what Hi. you can make. It'll take a while. It'll take a while until work is done. Please go kill some time somewhere. Hell yeah. Now I am going to be the one to make some curry. Hey, there are some leftover curry ingredients. You gonna make some curry? Let's make some curry. Have I made it myself? Yeah, I, I think I have, at least once. This curry sure has a lot of ingredients, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. I've, I've actually looked at the recipe, the official recipe. It really has a lot of ingredients. It's kind of cool. Did I see you put fruit in there? Let me secret ingredient, apples. Grated fruit is frequently used as a secret ingredient in curry. The hint of sweetness makes for a subtle, delectable, delectable flavor. Apples are recommended due to their fiber. Stewing the apple will bring out its sweetness, balancing the spice of the curry. Huh, I never knew apples. Uh, huh, I never knew apples would go so well with the spicy curry. I got bored with the Mario act. You threw it all together with such gusto. Could it be that the secret ingredient is confidence? No, it's love, dumbass. Ah, uh, yeah, two points of guts. It's not a lot, but it's something. Nice! The curry's... Well, I mean, you get a little bit of something, but the real prize here is the curry. I think it's, what, 50 for every... <laughs> the animation of it, of it, just... That, that was cool, I like it. That recipe sure has some love and care behind it. 
Try eating it in the metaverse. Maybe it'll heal your wounds. No, it'll heal my mental health. You were given the chance to learn how to make curry, so don't let it go to waste. There may come a time you'll be asked to serve it to someone. Ooh, wouldn't hurt to hone your skills. We should rest for now. Got a big day tomorrow. Hi, honey. Welcome home. Here's your lockpicks. I mean, coming aroma. All right. I'll see you later. Kawakami. She thinks she's the only woman in my life. A woman was threatening boss? <laughs> A woman. Oh, wait. Do we not know who she is yet? She was going on about domestic abuse and taking the case to court and stuff. I think Makoto is realizing who we're talking about. What's up? Uh, is, is it? Is it really? So to summarize what you told us, Futaba is boss's daughter, and he's abusing her? I don't know him very well. Is he really the kind of person Not at all. There's no way. I would like to believe so as well, but we don't have any conclusive evidence. So does that mean we actually have to do, have to change Boss's heart? I don't I don't want to change Soji Bro's heart. Is it Alibaba? Probably. It. <clears throat> I've given you the calling card and told you the target's name. You should be ready for this. Why aren't you doing it? I told you I'd help you if you stole her heart. What seems to be the holdup? And how would Alibaba know that we have yet to steal uh, um, Futaba's heart? I also said I'd report your identity to the police if you didn't help me. Are you okay with that? I'm serious here. Right? Person. Yes. Well, he does have information they are a very us. selfish person. Anyways, this Futaba he's talking about have a palace? If so, we need keywords to get in. Try messaging him about him. Tell me her keywords. <laughs> Whoops. Keywords? What are you talking about? Are you just saying random stuff to dodge the issue? What are we supposed to do about this? I don't know. We'd be able to figure out Alibaba's identity if we could just meet with him. Try asking him if there's any way we could meet up. Let's meet somewhere. Me? With me? That will be difficult. I have reasons for not being able to go out. That's why I'm contacting you like this. He can't go out? Wait, I get it. You steal people's hearts directly. That might make things difficult. Extremely difficult. One moment. I'm thinking. Okay, it's a shame, but... I'm calling off the deal. <laughs> Stop looking into Futaba Sakura. Forget this ever happened. I won't. I won't report you to the police either. Don't worry. Sorry for taking your time. Now, if you'll excuse me. Wait a second. I sent the deals off. We're never going to speak of this again. Don't expect me to contact you anymore either. We're not done here. I can't find the account to respond to. Huh? Did he just shut the whole operation? Apparently. But why? This doesn't make any sense. Not only can Alibaba not go out, but he won't let us meet Futaba either. Well, it's none of our business now. We can't contact him anymore. But what do we do about Medjed? We won't be able to get Alibaba to help us with them now. Maybe they were just pranking us. They made that huge declaration, but they ain't done nothing since. <laughs> I bet we got them freaked out. You mean they backed out because they're afraid we'll change their hearts? Mm. Yep. And now it'd just make them look lame if they came out and apologized. But... Ah, I guess with I see. Alibaba and Medjet out of the picture, can we just say this case is closed? No. You do no, we have cannot. a point. I guess it is safe for us to relax a little. 
Oh yeah, remember Kaneshiro's treasure? Prepare to have your minds blown. Twenty-third. Oh wow. We got. We're really close. Fifty thousand yen out of it. So tomorrow's a double plot That's day. That's awesome. We can really go all out with that kind of money. Yeah. Let's make up for what happened at the fire. Where I need festival. max pressure. Gotta go eat something more. fitting for the Phantom Thieves' worldwide mm. debut. Mm, where would be good? Ooh, how about sushi? I could really go for some eel too. The best method is to fill yourself on ginger. No, it's not, Yusuke. Is my oh my god. Technique. You don't need to do that this time. Actually, definitely don't do it. Okay. You don't need to do that this time. Actually, definitely don't do it. Okay. I love that line. You don't need not that to do part. that this time. Actually, definitely don't do that it. That part. Okay. Okay. I'm all for sushi. You're okay with that too, right? Any other ideas? Cause I don't like sushi. Nope. I you mean sushi. not have sushi? All right. I don't care if Faki Ren likes sushi. I hate sushi. Actually, I don't hate sushi. It's just difficult to eat, and it's not because it's raw fish. <clears throat> I wonder if all that Medjid business was just a prank. Now that I think about it calmly, it's strange that they haven't actually done anything yet. If their goal is to target the Phantom Thieves, they should want to act to be acting now, given our fame. Huh? When you put it like that, it kind of makes me wonder too. Especially after they taunted us theatrically like that. Yes. However, it would be best for us to come up with a countermeasure regardless. For now, though, we should cautiously enjoy the sushi. That is all we can do. Something's not right. I was thinking that too. I can't really put it into words, though. Hmm, Yusuke's right. I'm sorry for bringing this up on the day before our celebration party, too. Cheer up, Makoto. We'll be eating sushi like kings tomorrow. I hope one person in particular is on their best behavior. I'll refrain from saying who, though. It will be me. You better not be talking about me. Who knows? He could be talking about anybody. It's got a Terra Terra Bozu. It's so cool. Hmm. Taka Morgana? Do you think Alibaba calling off the deal has anything to do with the chief? It's so hard to tell what the truth is in the situation. Right. Um. So Saturday does not have coffee. Which means we're going to have... Or does not have curry. Which means we're going to call Kawa Coffee. Yep. Hi. And then, ironically, we're going to read a book. So, which one was I going to read? You know what? I kind of want to read the pro darts, but... I should have a courage one, no? No, I only have kindness. Not a bad thing, it's just a little surprising. So maybe my courage is ahead of the curve? Nah, that can't be right. Hmm. Nightlife hotspots. Oh, I should get the... the... Alright, so we're gonna read Zoro. The man in the mask stood up for the weak and fought valiantly against injustice. Make sure you read extra close pension. Zoro is cool. You still got time to read. Let's, let's go work more. Although his opponent was a true villain, he still behaved as a perfect gentleman and did not kill him. So you finished reading Zoro the Outlaw. It was a good movie. The Mask of Zoro. Zoro was not only strong in mind and body, but he also cared greatly for the common people. It seems you really understood his qualities. Mm -hmm. Plus five to kind. Man, kindness is so far behind. But it will max out pretty quickly once I start focusing on it. And once I start focusing on it, I'll be really focusing on it. Okay, when, when is the 7th? 
Ooh. Oh, but that's a calling card day, Hi. so that's not happening. Yeah. Thank you for waiting. Here you go, La Blanca. See you later. After we do some hanky panky. Actually, I don't think Kawakami and Joker. You seem quite busy, Sai san. I take it you're stuck in the Do anything of unless you do a hangout outside of the, um. the thingy. The Phantom Thieves made a mockery of us when they brought down Shiro. <laughs> And to make matters worse, Mejid, who has been dormant for some time now, just declared bum, war. Bum, bum. How much more can they screw us over? Stress is bad for the Lol. skin, you know. Did you come all this way simply to yes. be sarcastic? Yes. Because he is snarky. How about you listen to my deductions for a change of pace? You may think it absurd, but don't you think the case you are pursuing and the actions of the Phantom Thieves overlap somehow? Mm, perhaps. What are you basing this off of? The one point of commonality across all cases is how those involved have an unforeseen change an unforeseen of heart. Change of heart. I've suspected that myself, but those suspicions are unfounded. Bum, bum, bum. I told you at the beginning that this was only a deduction. These just phantom thieves are riling up the public. However, that is <gasps> a surprise. Their true goal is terrorist action by way of psychotic breakdowns. Is that too much? Right. There's nothing at the moment that falsifies that claim. Have you mentioned this Man, to that's, police? Man, that's such a far out. I mean, it's, they have uh, is in their mobility and organization. I don't know how to feel about his accusation there. Hmm. I know why. I know why he's accusing us, but jeez. I'm glad to hear that. What about your case, Sai-san? Did you learn anything from the guardian of that mental shutdown victim's daughter? Nothing at all. Guardian of a mental shutdown's daughter. So, the daughter's mother had a mental shutdown. Interesting. Presumably, that would be Wakaba who had the mental shutdown. Based on the, the small clues that we have here, that's not a hard conclusion to come to. I see. Now. What should my next action be for our victory? Victory, victory. Handle the phantom thieves without Yikes. remorse. Use any means Yikes. necessary to win. That's how I would deal with them. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't do that. That's Very cheating. Well. You're not allowed to, to cheat. For you. No cheating. Are you on to something? No, not at all. Well then, to our victory. Victory, victory. Okay. Time for sushi. No, sushi bad. No sushi. This place is in Ginza, right? Do we take the usual train from Shibuya? Oh, hey, Ginza. Oh, I see. It's called the Ginza line because it goes to Ginza. Duh. So, wait. Oh, this is a sushi place. Wait, are we actually going to the sushi right. bar? What? Okay, wait. Something's gonna happen here, and it's gonna... They actually are having sushi. Why, why did I think they weren't gonna have sushi? Man, the flounder is out of this world. Mm, that texture. No. Uh, I don't see any... <laughs> it's called market price. Don't worry about it, we got Are you cash. sure? <laughs> Fatty tuna. That's such a meme at this point. By the way, is Boss really the kind of person who would No, he's not. Bad again? I mean, I can I can't get it off my mind. Especially if it means he could be taken. I I get why she would be concerned, but uh she really doesn't need to be. Hmm. So I act 
Uh, so, uh, perving on Anzu time, right? Yeah, since we have this angle. Um, there's not really much cleavage to see there. So I'm suspecting that Anzu's not wearing a bra. I mean, it could also just be that this angle wouldn't give us a good view of any cleavage. I mean, the main thing here is that there's no lines to indicate. Granted, that could just be part of the shaders that they're, they're using. Because... Uh, unless there's, like, a big crease, like Ryuji's elbow. Uh, but then also looking at Anzu's elbow, there is no crease. I don't know. The shaders are, are interesting on this. Like, it's the, They're just enough that they give outlines where, or where you really need outlines to be. But it's not so heavy-handed that there are outlines everywhere on the characters. And then the rest of it is light-based, where... Yeah, it's interesting. And I'm sure there's a lot of work that went into getting the shaders to react to the light just right. And I also, I also wonder then, is each individual character being affected by a separate light, or are they all being affected by the same light? And I'm not talking about lights in the environment, I'm talking about a light object in the game programming that causes the effects. I don't know, but as a technically minded person these are the things I think about which is funny that looking down on the shirt is what got me there <laughs> alright moving on what kind of person is he do you truly believe he'd do such a thing Mm, he is pretty strict. Oh, because of your record. Absolute. If it's really true about the abuse, he'd be a no good jerk pretending. Let's to change his heart. Maybe the chief is the one who needs. Yeah, we'll to change his heart. Hold on a sec. We'll change his heart. I actually got curious after our conversation and checked. Oh wow. Good on you, on. Wow. <laughs> Anzu's thinking ahead. Sounds to me like there wasn't a hit. Right. Anything beyond this is his family's problem. We probably shouldn't get any more involved. Wait, you think Alibaba could be boss? <laughs> yes, that's that is absolutely correct, Ryuji. <laughs> he must have cheated on her, and that's where Futaba came from. <gasps> wow. <laughs> imagination has right? been rampant. How foolish. Silly Ryuji. Mm. Still, this is delicious. I've never experienced anything quite Meh. like it before. Man, and it's all Ha! 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 So it in other words, Ryuji just said <clears throat> WE ARE THE PHANTOM THIEVES! That's not my meme, but I have to meme it. Fantastic! This sushi is delicious! Y yeah The fish is so fresh! No. <laughs> Everywhere we go, we hear about these phantoms- Nautica, what are you doing here? Sorry, it just kind of slipped. My apologies for bringing up boss again. We should just enjoy the food. Nom 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 nom. Evening, Sunday. Akechi. 
What are you doing here? We're about to a catchy a train. A catchy? You're the ones from the TV station. Could it be that your friends of Nijima? -san? Something like that. Do you know this guy? Oh yeah, he nice wouldn't have met. You. My name is Akechi. Glad to make your acquaintance, Yusuke uh -huh. Tagawa. How do you... Whoops. Well, because I'm a yeah, psychic, right. of course. So, Makoto has a very worried look on her face. It's very interesting. Anzu has a very blank face. Ryuji has, you know, a resting bitch face. And Yusuke's like, who are you? But Makoto's just like... Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! <laughs> I'm only joking. In truth, I'm a rookie detective. You're a former pupil of Madarame, right? I have actually just recently joined the investigation team looking into the Phantom Thieves. Did you see that Mejed has declared war on them? And now Makoto's thinking, "Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh fuck! Oh fuck!" Just like it's all merging into one huge "We're so fucked" line. Their website was updated just a moment ago. For real? Ah, English again. I found my booze, so I have to do it. Why? Why, Ryuji? Why? Don't look at me in that tone of face. Beef was glaring at me. It's been a while since I've had a shot of the fire, the fiery whiskey. I do like it. It's, it is pretty tasty. Sin fire. It's not fireball. Sin fire. Here's to the for real. English again. Wait, what? And of course, An can read it. What to say? Huh. Why do you seem so agitated? Oh, um. She's uh, a huge fan of the Phantom Thieves. Total <laughs> nut job, Wow, Ryuji. Hmm. I don't know how wise it is to be a fan of groups hey, like. Hey, I'm them. a fan. What is with these comments? My apologies. I didn't mean to butt into your conversation, but I must say, this is an interesting group. Prosecutor Nijima's sister, an ex-pupil of Madarame, and a few Shujin Academy ha! students. It seems you're all connected. To the, the only two students. notable. Perhaps you have better intel. Than the only two notable ones are Makoto and Yusuke. The rest of our are just faceless masses. Ah, yes. I wanted to ask you something. Regarding this whole Mejed commotion, if you were one of the Phantom Thieves, what would you do? I would eat chocolate. What would we do, I wonder? I would retaliate. Hmm. So you share the majority's opinion. Sorry to disappoint, but we're just normal high school kids. If anything, we want to hear what you got to say, Mr. Detective. My profiling of the Phantom Thieves has led me to believe they are a group of Damn. criminals. They have a relative amount of free time after school and a hideout to sleep. Wow! He has our number. Holy shit! Like, there's almost no way he doesn't know it's us. <laughs> Considering Kamashita was their first target, it seems they began activity around April. In a way, all I've just said about the Phantom Thieves coincides with the group you have here. Yeah, just a little bit. What? You gonna report us? I didn't say I was being Liar. suspicious of you. Good to hear. <laughs> <laughs> Me? You're siding with him? I wasn't anticipating that response. You always find a way to rise above my expectations. 
You really are an intriguing one. <laughs> I lack your calm mannerisms. But don't you think my deduction is an interesting one? Yes, yes it is. And I'm sorry, Ryuji. I had to do it. I had to do it. After all, you're always shouting at the top of your lungs, we are the Phantom Thieves. Oh my god. I forgot we had that kind of option. Wow. I bet we'd make a great team if we work together. <laughs> <laughs> yes, actually it is true. Akechi would make a pretty good teammate. In fact, I dare say he might be more intelligent than Makoto. Sorry, Makotes. Senpai, you just uh not you're not a detective. What? What are you saying? <laughs> well, this has been a valuable point of reference for me. I hope to see you all again. What was that about? You think he's ascertained our Perhaps, true perhaps not. Who knows? Nah, couldn't be. Right? I'd like to say that it's simply us overthinking this, but maybe best to be cautious. It sounded like now beef was thrown up. Forget that Alibaba was able to discover who we are. He's not. True, but it's not as though he had tangible evidence to prove that discovery. Just keep acting normally. More importantly, things are getting serious with Medjet. Oh yeah. What they wrote, it? "Suck my balls, yeah, Ryuji." I'll read it. We are disappointed in the people of Japan and their belief in the Phantom Thieves' false justice. Hence, we shall proceed with our plan to cleanse Japan. This process will commence on August 21st. As a result, the Japanese economy shall suffer devastating damages. Whoa. For, real? For real. Keep going. However, we are magnanimous. We will oh. give the Phantom Thieves one final opportunity to repent. As proof of this repentance, we demand that they reveal their identity. Oh, we'll get to that. We will attack if these demands remain unmet. The future of Japan rests with the Phantom Thieves. We are Majed. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. I kind of want the Phantom Thieves to join the Shadow Operatives. That'd be really cool. That's what it says. Mm, sounds bad. In other words, if we don't unmask ourselves, Medjet will attack Japan, correct? And it seems they are quite the attention seekers. What are we gonna do about this? Only we could get in contact with Alibaba. Our only clues are Boss and Futaba. Anyways, it's too damn hot out here. Why don't we go to Leblanc? We can talk more over there. We went through all sorts of options on our way here, but looks like we got no choice but to ask for Alibaba's help. Question is, how do we get in touch with him? He cut off all contact with us after that misunderstanding. Then again, if we manage to steal Futaba's heart, he may attempt to reach out to us once more. But we don't have any clues on what her keywords are. Damn it, Alibaba! Where the hell are you? Actually, he may be closer than we think. Huh? Hypothetically speaking, even if we stole Futaba's heart, how would Alibaba know that the deed has been done? Would he truly be able to discern that what? just from cell phone messages? If I pick you up, you're gonna get Maybe angry when I go person. and voice act again. Alibaba was able to deliver the calling card here. On top of that, he can check on Futaba's condition. However, according to the circumstances Fine, here before, come here. He's unable to meet with us. This leads me to believe that it would be bad for him if we were to see the two of them together. It seems to me Alibaba may in fact be Futaba. Le gasp. Alibaba oh, is you? Futaba. So she's asking that we steal her own heart? Maybe she wants us to save her from the scars of her abuse. That would be hard to ask directly. I'd like to meet with Boss. He lives nearby, right? I know where his house is. I agree. It's real late, though. What are we going to tell Boss when we get there? We'll say this takeout sushi is a gift. Right. But my bag 
Nope. Sorry, cat. You get nothing. No complaining. Let's all go Hi. together. Boss may get the wrong idea if he and I show up alone. Nobody's answering. Le Goust. No one's the answering. Oh no! Oh no! Even Boss would have woken up with how many times we've rung this doorbell. So then, where is he? I would think Futaba would have answered by now if she were here too. Ah, oh, the gate is unlocked. Dude, you can't go opening other people's right? stuff like that. How dare you, Yusuke? But look, the door seems to be slightly open as well. I wonder why. That's rather uh, careless. I mean, yeah, that's true. Why is everything open? It sounds like that it's is really weird. Beef, we I told inside. you you're not gonna like it when I start Do you talking. Think that's okay. I don't know. Probably. My apologies, boss. Sorry. I'm gonna keep talking, you know, though. Hello, sir. He's not out. Is uh, he? yeah, he the is. The head is open, and I can hear the TV. I hope he didn't pass out or something. I mean, boss is kind of. Oh away. wow. I'm a bit worried. Should we go in sure. and check on him? Please excuse us. <laughs> nice. should I know? Did you hear that? Let's get out of here, please! Can we just go? What are you freaking out for? I I'm not Yes, you are, Anzu. Yes, you are. Maybe Alibaba? I mean, Futaba? Futa... F uh... Futalibaba? Uh, sorry. Um... Can I... Oh my god, hand? she's adorable. Makoto, why are you so adorable? I can sense someone. I can sense a ghost. Is this is great. I love this. I can't take this anymore. I'm leaving. No, no. my legs won't move. Ah, beef. Fine. Climb my shoulder. See if I care. I'm keeping my head up. God damn it, Beef, you made me miss the thing. Off. Hey! Brat. Where are you? You're a hacker, right? Just show yourself. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Please save me, sis. Wow. Are you okay, Futaba? Oh, he is home. Crap, he's home. Get everyone else hides. Grabs a flashlight. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, sis. Somebody please save me. <laughs> Makoto is so adorable. She's just terrified. You? What are you doing in my house? This is really mean, just leaving it on the screen just to see her shaking in fear. Poor Makoto. <laughs> and then, and then look at me. I'm just a cool cat, standing there, stoic as always. My glasses cannot be seen through. Hands in my pockets. I'm a cool ass boy. Oh hey, here, there's his fedora. Yes! Meeting? Yes, we are! We're just friends. <laughs> friends nowadays get that For close now. to each other? But that's not it! This, um, uh, things happened and... Kit! You kids are and they shouldn't too? have hid anyway. Um, we brought you some sushi, but nobody answered when we rang the bell. The door was unlocked too. We could hear the TV though, so we got worried he might have passed out or something. Which is true. True Door's enough. Unlocked? Yes. Uh, I knew 
that sometimes. Because I'm getting old. I'm glad. Um, excuse me. There's something we'd like to ask. I'm glad Sojiro isn't super pissed at them. He's just like, well, this happened. I've kind of asked for it for leaving it unlocked. You want to ask me? There's someone else living here. Isn't there? Yeah. My daughter. Could hmm? she Wait a minute. Be Utapa Sakura? Wait a minute. Is Makoto barefoot? I guess they all took off their shoes, huh? Interesting. I mean, it's part of Japanese culture, when you enter someone's house, you take off your shoes. Um, and normally you would wear slippers around the house, uh, but I doubt Sojiro has enough guest slippers for all of them. Interesting. You told Nijima-san too? Uh, um, is there any way we could meet with Futaba-san? I think we may have frightened her earlier, so we'd like to apologize if at all possible. Well, actually, it looks like that's... Anzu's wearing slippers. Is she sick? Unless her socks are just that sh no, that, that short, like that. and only covers her toes. Yeah, I guess those are <sighs> socks. That's weird. I don't want you all getting the wrong idea. I shouldn't have kept this a secret. No, you shouldn't. Let's talk at my shop. She'll hear us if we stay She'll here. hear you in the shop. No. I mean, Where what? Do I Why would we know that? No, we know. Futaba's not. mother and I knew each other long before Futaba was born. Her mother was a bit of a weird one, but we got along well for some reason. She was sharp-witted, somewhat stern, a little socially inept, but always careful. So she was a priestess. She truly was a great woman. I see. When something piqued her interest, that'd be all she focused on. She always worked deep into the night. I thought that'd change after. So she's a priestess. Life. But having Futaba didn't do much. Even with that, she always took good care of her. Working and watching over a child at the same time sounds rough. I guess raising Futaba alone turned out to be tough on her in more ways than one. What about her father? There wasn't a father. Do you mean... Well, there probably was one. I didn't know him, though. She never said a word about him, either. She was single when she gave birth to Futaba, and single when she raised her. They were an ordinary, loving family. You could really tell how much she cared. So there's a running theory, and there's absolutely nothing to confirm this. But there, the, as the theory goes, uh, the father was... Damn brat, I'll sue! That guy. Uh, because, as we saw at the very beginning, he's not above forcing himself on a woman. And, uh... Yeah. And then I think... I think he was... And we'll, we'll learn this later, but I think he was involved in the cognitive science somehow i forget exactly what the involvement was but i think he was if i'm remembering correctly either way we'll get to him don't worry we'll get to him but one day she left no 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 she didn't leave did she die Yes. She committed suicide. Except, except, suicide. except, we actually know that it wasn't simply suicide. Because a catch you let slip, it was a psychotic breakdown. Wait a minute. If Sojiro, the man who is closest to her, knew, or, or is under the impression that it was suicide and but then Akechi Akechi who seems to have absolutely nothing to do with it says it was a psychotic breakdown hmm hmm 
Hmm. Very, very interesting. I feel like that might be foreshadowing for something. But, I also don't think people would be able to put that together. Like, of course, I'm using hindsight. I've played through the original game. But that's actually really interesting. Like, if, you, if you're really paying attention to what's going on here, and you see... And, and you, you take note of the fact that Akechi said psychotic breakdown. Sojiro, who is the guardian of her daughter... Basically, he adopted her, right? So, the mother, in his, in his eyes, committed suicide. That's what he knows. He doesn't say anything about her having a, psych a psychotic breakdown. As far as he's concerned, that's not what happened. So, either he doesn't know that it was a, it was a, psycho, a psycho breakdown. Or... The suicide is all the he cares about, psychotic breakdown or not. I, but the but I don't. That's very interesting, and of course I'm overanalyzing it, partially because I have uh, foreknowledge, and also because it actually just it is a very interesting point to examine. Anyway, let's lower the microphone a little bit so it's not all up in my face. I can still be heard if I talk loud enough. Suicide? Hang on. Suicide? Threw herself into the street. Right in front of Futaba's eyes. Shocking doesn't begin to describe that. It's gotta be devastating for a kid. So... Well, a lot happened after that, but I ended up taking custody of Futaba. First, she was so depressed, she... She wouldn't even talk to me. Was that because she couldn't get over her mother's suicide? I kept talking to her, though. And she started opening up to me, little by little. That's when I found out Utaba blames herself for her mother's ba -ba -ba. death. What? But why? That part, she's never told me. I wanted to know what led her to believing that. But I decided not to rub salt. No, you should have pushed. Then... You should have pushed. Ago, she started getting real scared. Even when nothing mm -hmm. was happening, she'd say things like, I hear voices and mom is looking at me. Visual and auditory oh. hallucinations. Have you taken Futaba to a doctor? You know what else happened a few months ago within the game? Kamoshida. We got the navigate the, the nav app. And considering, slight spoilers, but considering Futaba's role in the Phantom Thieves, because, let's face it, we know she's going to be a Phantom Thief. Like... Uh, it, hmm, here we go. Art book. Um... I mean, one, she's on the cover. Two, the... Um, so this this is the art book that came with the original... Um, oh wait, Yusuke, Makoto, after Makoto. Here we go. So this is this is the art book that came... And this, this specifically is Futaba's page. Here we go. So there we can, we can plainly see that it is the girl in the room with the computers. And we, we, we get told through this that her name is Futaba Sakura. It's Futaba. So, Futaba being a phantom thief is in no way an actual spoiler. People who are gonna try and tell me otherwise, fuck off. A spoiler is not something to get all bent out of shape over. Yes, I know. I have in my rules down below, no spoilers unless the game is over th over three months old. But that's assuming I'm going to be playing a brand new game and am completely blind. Uh, 
I'm kind of weird when it comes to spoilers. On the one hand, I love obtaining new information. On the other hand, when I'm in the midst of playing or watching or reading a thing, like in the middle of it, that's when I don't really want spoilers. But if I'm not currently, not, uh, not invested, that's not the word, engrossed, I guess? Like, yeah, anyway, that's when I don't want spoilers. So basically, when I'm streaming the game, I don't want spoilers. Uh, otherwise, I don't care. I'll look up spoilers all I want. In fact, I already know the truth about Kasumi. <clears throat> and a little bit about Mr. Counselor. I wasn't really intending to learn about those. Uh, but... The, ow. This has spoilers in it. And... I really wanted to be able to, to get as much mechanical information as I could to plan out my uh, path through the game. So, I was expecting it. I was expecting there to be spoilers in that, and there are, and I'm okay with it. And no, spoilers do not ruin my enjoyment of a, of a story. It's not about what happens, it's about how it happens. It's not about knowing the end. It's about watching it happen. That is that is my take on spoilers. A lot of people have this weird backwards expectation of spoilers where they need to be completely blind. They, they can't even know what the title of a thing is because, oh no, titles have spoilers, don't you know? I mean, a lot of people argue the title is not spoilers, but I don't think they'll even read the synopsis for fear of spoilers. Like, what? That's ridiculous. Anyway, I need to stop ranting because we need to get through this cutscene because it's almost 10. Um, I'll go a little bit over 10. Uh, but I think... I think this is going to be... Yeah, this will be the last... Um, well, actually... Yeah, the next save point. The next opportunity I have to save, which might be right after this it might be on the next day i wanted to but she refused even when i had a doctor come she locked herself ba -ba -ba. away in the room since then she's become what you'd call hikikomori she won't take a single step outside the house or even try she's to also see kind her. of a neat what about you she doesn't even let me come in her room that's pretty harsh utaba is well, a genius girl. She's so quick-minded that conversations with her tend to jump from one topic she's to the She's a genius. Next. It seems like she's always coming to conclusions in her head. There's a lot I don't get about her. Hmm. So, yeah, her situation is why I couldn't let you in my house. What Futaba needs is a safe Okata. place where nobody will threaten her. Somewhere she can be at ease. That's why I won't do anything she doesn't want. I don't make her do anything she's unwilling to, either. Then again, I know that's no way for her to live. It's all I can do, though. What does Futaba want? I don't know. She just asks me for things that she wants, like food or these complicated, complicated books. books. Hacking books! Well, that's that. So, can you just... Leave her be. I'm gonna head back then. You all had better head home soon. It is too. getting late. Probably around midnight, actually. I feel awful for prying into his personal affairs. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her, though? Probably. If we can well, help her, we may be able to it's not so much that we need to change her heart as it is we need to change her cognition. Which is, there is, a, there is actually a difference. Change, because, like, changing one's cognition is an outside-in kind of thing, whereas changing one's heart is an inside-out, where you... Basically, change of heart is 
have the shadow change its mind, and changing the cognition is having the person change their mind. It's actually a rather interesting difference in stuff. Although... I guess that's slight like spoilers. But not really. It is and it isn't. We need more clues. Hold on a sec. Do we even know if she has a palace? Let's, Let's check. check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. And that's that a little more than enough. Candidate found. What the? She's got one. Indeed. So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. Morgana's not gonna. Where's Morgana? I haven't seen him for some oh. time. Oh. Huh. So ever since we went inside Boss's house? Somewhere Wait. In there. He'll be fine though. He's a I'm surprised that no one noticed him jump out of the bag. The night soon, so we should probably be heading home. We have to go to school in the morning after all. Oh, right. The urgent assembly. An assembly? What about? Shujin has been garnering a lot of attention ever since Medjet called out the Phantom Thieves. So they need to remind us not to say arbitrary stuff online and add more fuel to ha! the fire. We'll do that anyway. We gotta meet up for every goddamn little thing. <sighs> Talk about a pain in the ass. I mean, it is our but fault. But no. Anyway, let's contact each other afterward. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her, though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjet. Uh... The, is this them continuing the conversation? Or did they already say all this? I don't... I don't remember them saying all that. No, yeah, they're continuing the conversation here. What? Unless... Wait. No. What? Did I miss something? Oh, yeah, okay. Wow, how did I miss that part of the conversation? I was not paying attention. <laughs> Oops. Hold on a sec. Do we even know there it is. A That's where I started paying attention again. <laughs> the Futaba Sakura that lives at wow. Sojiro Sakura's house. I am bad person. Is that gonna be enough? What the? She's got one. So someone can have a palace, even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. Where's Morgana? <laughs> kitty kitty! Where'd Morgana go? I Wouldn't he be stuck in her room? He can't open her door. He can't escape through the... That's weird. So... Oh, we can't go anywhere. Can we leave? Oh, okay, okay, okay. At least they give us this excuse. This is this is a fair excuse as to why we can't do anything. He wants to make sure he doesn't miss Morgana. Okay, I will. Oh wait, 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 wait. Okay, never mind. Okay, never mind. Damn it. Damn it, Morgana. Oh, wait again. Wait, 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 wait again. This is a saving opportunity. I'm a dumbass. It's time to end. I did say next save opportunity, we're, we're ending stream. Okay, here we go. Uh, where is my brain? My brain is nowhere. Thank you all for watching. YouTube, do the thing. You know what it is. Um, I've been thinking of maybe doing some morning streams um so maybe if i wake up early enough tomorrow and if i go to bed tonight uh i might do a stream around nine o'clock maybe uh anyway be vigilant 
maybe I'll pop in and do another stream. Uh, that would be cool. Yeah, that would be cool. Uh, it might not be Persona 5. It might be Persona 5. I haven't actually decided. But yeah, so until we meet again, farewell.